Today we're talking about Mama D and Bambi. Mama D and Bambi are into it again about Shay Jensen's baby shower. Let's take a look at this video. <laughs> Oh my oh. freaking god, these are half people, so they're here. Okay, come here, baby. No, stay, go this way because the light. Okay. No, stand okay. up. All right. I want to show y'all who's here. The baby shower is over. We're here. It's Peter's bar one. Peter's bar he don't one. even answer the freaking phone when I call him. So, Peter, you have failed me. And then you got your, your worker to answer the phone and put me on the phone. He answered the phone for me, that's my friend. He didn't answer the phone. He just, you know he's not here anymore. I, I mean, not. But Peter. Hey, my baby. Hey, <laughs> love you. I love you. You know, I told you, my mom. You see, thank you for sharing this moment. She's a good girl. I know. You know, and you've had your hurdles with her, but it's okay. Do y'all think that Shay was being a little messy by showing that Mama D was at the baby shower? I feel like she should have just kept it to herself. Let's take a look at what Mama D wrote on Instagram. I'm down for who down for me. I've never heard Bam even give a freak about what I ate, send me flowers for my birthday, give me a greeting card. I'm supposed to leave Shay alone because she's insecure. She's freaking insecure and she's dragging my son and my son and I are not on speaking terms. Well, I guess Bambi got a hold of the message and she wrote... Keep, please have that same energy you got on Instagram the next time you see me in person. I'm sick of you trying me, and I'm always giving you a pass and making excuses for your behavior. Keep my name out of your mentions and your mouth. You must need some attention tonight. Then Mama D wrote, I never thought loving someone with good intentions would cause my life to be threatened behind a picture of me and I am Shay Jensen. But it's all good in the palace and at Sheryl Whitfield voice. Who gonna check me, boo? Bambi can't be worrying about what Mama D do because Scrappy can't control her. She her own woman. Like the people said back in the day, when you marry the man, you marry the family. If you don't like the mother and the mother doesn't like you, it's always going to be trouble in paradise. So ladies, check that family out first before you sign the dotted line. Do y'all think they are arguing because love and hip-hop is filming, or do you think this is real-life drama? Let me know in the comments. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more videos. Thanks for watching, and bye-bye.